Did you know that July is National Grilling Month? And here with the latest in barbecue essentials that you and your family have got to check out, our friend Limor Sus. Limor, good morning. It's great to see you. Good morning. Yes, I have so many delicious options for you guys today. I love it. By the way, is that a hot dog bar on your table? I can't see a lot, but that definitely stands out to me. Oh, yes. I love setting up a hot dog bar. What I do is I grill up some hot dogs. You either serve them in a bun or just put the buns on the side and then add all different toppings. So over here, I have some chili and cheese. I have sauerkraut and onions. I also have different pickles and pepperoncinis. You can have relish, whatever toppings you want on your hot dog bar, you can set it up. And it's so fun to, for everyone to make their own creation. And one of the things that I always get asked is what hot dogs should I be buying and should I be using? And so over here, I have Applegate's cleaner and greener hot dog, the do good dog hot dog. It's the first nationally available hot dog made with beef, raised with practices that regenerate the land. It's gluten-free, a good source of protein, and contains no added sugar. And in honor of National Hot Dog Day, Applegate is actually offering approximately 70% off their Do Good Dog Hot Dogs through a one-day-only coupon, which you can get at applegate.com slash dogood. It's redeemable at Whole Foods Market and Walmart through January 30th, 2023. So you can get the coupon now, and then you can buy a hot dog through, uh, you know, January. Nice. Hey, Lemur, true story. Uh, we had friends over not too long ago, and I had like all of these dips set out, and I didn't realize one of my friends had actually gone gluten free. I was scrambling. I felt terrible. Do you have any staples that kind of make sure everyone can enjoy those dips if they are gluten free? Yeah, 100%. You know, I actually, um, you know, the more that that's, hap that's happening to me more and more, where someone's like, hey, I'm gluten free, and I just, I never really paid attention, right? And so over here, I have some. Um, absolutely delicious, absolutely gluten-free uh, crackers that you're going to love, your guests are going to love. They just happen to be gluten-free. They're light, they're delicious. And so right in front of me, I have the absolutely original crackers. I have the absolutely gluten-free everything flatbreads. They are so delicious with different dips. So over here, I have a dill pickle uh, and ranch dip. I have guacamole and salsa. And I got to tell you, the guacamole on the everything flatbread is just so, so delicious. And of course, I also have a cheese platter in front of me. So you just have all the absolutely gluten-free crackers with the different cheeses and nuts and dried fruit. The absolutely gluten-free crackers just happen to be gluten-free. They're absolutely delicious. They are flour-free, made with potato, but they have no soy, corn, or rice. And you can get them at Publix and on Amazon. Well, now that you've completely made us all hungry, uh, what do you have to wash everything down? Maybe like a summery drink to kind of celebrate, you know, July as we've already touched on. Yes, definitely. So I, one of my new favorite finds is Wonder Melon, and it actually comes in two great flavors. There's watermelon cucumber basil and watermelon lemon cayenne. It's 100% organic cold breast juices. It has only five ingredients. There are no added sugars, no artificial flavor or coloring. It's non-GMO and it's less than 100 calories per bottle. And they're absolutely delicious. You can get it at wondermelonjuice.com. You can actually make them into popsicles like you see on the screen there. You can actually also make them into a cocktail. So all I've done is I just get the watermelon juice. You can do vodka, tequila, rum, whatever you want to put in there. And then uh, just mix it up. You can add a lime uh, or a lemon as a garnish. It's so good. It's so refreshing. And I got to tell you, it's just summer in a bottle. <laughs> I may or may not have done the cocktail version. The popsicle thing, though, that is a great idea as well. I love it. Good stuff. I got to tell you, it's so good. I think, I think <laughs> my favorite is in the popsicle. I'm going to have to try that one. Hey, Lemore, great checking in with you. How can people stay in touch with you? Yeah, so you can go to lemore.tv to find these and so much more. And you can go to follow me at Lemore Sauce on Instagram. Good stuff. Take care, okay? And uh, happy grilling month. Happy July, right? Oh, I know. And I'll see you guys soon with some more, with some more ideas. Nice. Looking forward to it. Take care. Bye.